Let's take that triple. Hello, everybody. I'm Old Guy Gamer. This is American Truck Sim I'm playing today. I actually just dropped off at a Walmart in Helena, Montana, and I'm over here now at what looks to be a Walmart distribution center, maybe? Anyways, we're picking up a triple trailer. I've never done one of these before, so I figure, what the heck? Let's do it. Let's jump on the road and head out. I would imagine driving triple trailer, obviously going to be heavier, obviously going to be longer, but I have a feeling they will trail the track. The, 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 tra the trailers should trail the tractor better than a double. be interesting to see. Let's see. There it's inside the box. That's inside the box. Second trailer real axle not in the box. So, it just seems like the more articulation you have, the better it trails around a corner. See? It wasn't even close to that curb. That's awesome. Anyways, um, we're headed from Helena to Thompson Falls. Going from a Walmart, I think, to the UPS. It says I need sleep in six hours. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess I do have to turn here. I picked this delivery because it was the shortest one available. And it's still going to take me... Oh, I have 20 hours to get there, but it's only 4 hours and 52 minutes away. So I won't have to sleep on this video. I can just get there and get there. It's only 10.20 in the morning. i got 6 hours of wait time remaining. I am going to get 2 jobs done on one day. I will take it. Hope you guys are doing well. It's a... Oh my god, what was that? Dude just steered right into me and they give me the offense? That is some BS right there. It was an uncontrolled intersection. He's turning left. Why would they blame me for that? I just got my truck fixed. Idiot. No wonder I hate everybody. Anyways. I guess we'll head to Thompson Falls, make our delivery, and then fix our truck again. I literally just went to the Western Star dealer right there, next to the pickup point, and got my truck serviced and repaired and fixed and perfect. Picked up a delivery right next door, and crash within a couple miles of my pickup point. My gosh, that's just dumb. I don't know what the heck the guy was thinking. He wasn't he's clearly not gonna beat me. The only thing I could see him doing was stopping. There's no way I could foresee that guy being that much of an idiot and turning right into the front left corner of the truck. Moron. Anyways, welcome to another video. Um, I know that this isn't going to count towards the World of Trucks event because I didn't... I don't know. I tried to get an external contract. That didn't work. This this video, this trip is going to have the same problem as the last one. I'm picking up and delivering in Montana. And it's not going to count for the World of Trucks because the first one didn't. And this is the exact same method I used to pick this trip as I did for the first one, so it's just, it didn't work on that one, so it's not going to work on this one, so whatever. I've just picked this job because it's a triple trailer, and I wanted to drive it and deliver a triple trailer, so. The good news is, is I won't have to do a precise delivery when I get to where we're going. Hopefully it'll be just a pull in straight and park it kind of job. And we'll get to check another city off of our list in Montana. 
So let's hit the road. Let's get up to speed and let's see if we can figure out something to talk about. If you're from Montana, how are the police there? Are they really strict about enforcing traffic laws? Are they pretty lax? Like how fast can you go on these interstates before they start to pull you over and give tickets? I live in Illinois. The Illinois troopers seem to be pretty middle of the road. Indiana right next door to us, they seem to write a lot of tickets. Every time I drive through there, they've got people pulled over all the time. Same with Ohio, drive through there. Seems like they've always got people pulled over. I don't really see a whole lot of highway troopers in Wisconsin being super strict on like speed, specifically on interstates, but I do know there's a Wisconsin trooper up near Eau Claire that writes a lot of tickets because I've heard multiple people say they got stopped by the same trooper up there on their way to Mall of America or whatever. So if you're from Montana, let me know. What are the cops like out there? Because they just showed that traffic stop back there with the cop having someone pull over. There was a cop that had a di different car pulled over the last time I went past that spot. So is there something about this game that's true to form with real life? Is there really a lot of cops on the highways in Montana or is it pretty... Or is it just a fluke that there happen to be maybe two cops with someone pulled over in the same spot in the game? Maybe that's not based in reality. The reason I ask is because there's states in this game where it seems like you can go as fast as you want for as long as you want and you're not going to get pulled over. Utah is one of those states in this game where you could just speed all day long and never get a ticket. But California, you speed, you're going to get a ticket. So. Just curious what the reputation is for the Montana, the Montana police out there. Specifically, I'm looking for attitudes about the uh, reputation of the highway patrol or troopers, whatever you call them. Let's get off the brake a little bit here. actually been on this road before to do my u-turn when there was a detour at the interchange back there the first time I had to go through it loan installment of 7600 still got both loans to pay for I know the smaller hundred thousand dollar loan is almost completely paid for and when that one is paid for I will take out another four hundred thousand or whatever the biggest loan is I can take when I don't have two loans to pay for anymore. I'll take out another second loan. I am sure... Oh. Well, that was a bad assumption on my part. I thought I was going to have to go through the way station for sure. Guess not. Oh, that looks like a good exit right there with a roundabout right off the highway. Right into the truck stop and mechanic. I guess it's a, uh, I didn't notice if it was a truck stop. It just looks like one on the map. I was so focused on looking at the GPS, I didn't even look out the window to see what it looked like in real life. I'll tell you what, this truck is pulling this triple set of trailers pretty well. I can't complain. You know, if I could keep it in the lane, I'd be a lot happier, but... The engine's handling it. Oh my gosh. Get back on the road, man. I'm trying to do little inputs and then I'm correcting before I even pull off of the rumble strips. I'm going 86 and a 70. Oh my gosh. Let's see if this is going to be a big, long, gradual downhill. I might have to stay in the right lane just so I can ride that retarder. Nope, looks like it's going back up. I just got stuck behind a slow line of traffic. Finally 
get out behind that van. Someone needs some ice cubes. Three hours and 11 minutes of awake time. An hour and 20 minutes away, driving through Missoula. We got a turn coming up. We must be getting here. Oh. It says we're 37 miles away, so Thompson Falls must not be on the interstate. Make sure those trailers get around that corner. That looks like local flavor. 30 more miles to Thompson Falls. Let's just get there. Get some rest. Oh. Yeah, I hear you, buddy. There comes the train as we pass. is a distraction if I ever saw one, but very cool nonetheless. Oh, we are coming up on a stop sign pretty quick here. And there's a ranch. the Clark Fork River. I think it's the second time we've gone over it. Thompson Falls. Oh, you know what? I just realized it's probably called Thompson Falls because there's some waterfalls around here probably, huh? Should probably see if they included those in the game. And if it's only one fall, then hopefully they included it here. Trips. Let's head back in so we can make this delivery. We are entering Thompson Falls. I see a gas station. Hopefully this isn't one of those towns that has a gas station and some deliveries but no place to rest. Should be a pretty quick drop off though with not having to park it. guys I know this one's not going to count for the world of trucks event but we did get another Montana job done so I hope you enjoyed it we went from Helena to Thompson Falls pulling a triple trailer for Walmart there it is let's drop this anyways that's it I'll show you guys that it didn't give me the credit for it just to show you but that's it for now see zero out of 12 i've done three trips now in montana none of them's counted because i guess i'm not logged into world of trucks or something i don't know i'll figure it out next time till then you guys go watch some more videos and i'll go play some more games bye